As a three loan gunman, and at the moment, uh, one of other friend arrived on a cycle. Um, he was he stopped and check what was the problem. When one lone gunman, he snap his gun snap at him. A next gunman turn around and shot Jav in his forehead, and the one of them dropped. And the next young man that the gun snap on, he he end up the chase the one of the gunman, but the gunman fired a single shot through an alley, and the gunman exchanged word with the young man, and that was it. Good day, my wonderful friends. It's me again, the great. Great. One more great countryman remember to like, share, subscribe and click on another video. Now, only see the video when I play at the front. It's a little artist named Drunko. He asks me, say, yo, countryman, can't put my drop in front of your video them. So I'm gonna tell him, say, alright, time say, boy, me always I talk about violence. I see the violence they are weird. So, I tell him, say, yeah, man. So, me is fe fear. Because we always say as black people, yeah, man, we need to do like the Indian, the Chinese, and the this, but we don't practice it. Well, me, I practice when me preach. Me help anybody, black or white, especially black man. Now, as we move on, George Street man them are create enough dopey again. Now, you hear the young man explain, same in our alley, in bridging them a walk. A man pretend like him bike broke down. When the man them stop, a man come and put one right in our cranium. Now, this is a retaliation. This killing right here is a retaliation from George Street. The third Listen tragedy to this. for one family since the murder of Wagner's stepfather, Edwin Nasario, on July 12th. Police were called to the area, and upon arrival, they saw the lifeless body of Mr. Wagner on the ground. He was taken to the Southern Regional Hospital and uh, was pronounced dead on arrival. I must say that um, we sympathize with the, with the, with the mother. Uh, she must be going through a really tough time, having lost her Kamala husband, then a son, then a second son, um, to gun violence. There are now, a series of death has been plaguing this beleaguered family. The stepfather get robbed out at the house, then her son, the Migo one, him get robbed out of one party. They're saying it was drugs, but the word on the street is the ghost town crips, which that's who these guys are, ghost town crips. They are beefing with George Street Gang, and God Street Gang is taking them out bit by bit. Now, when you hear me say, I'm stressed out when I do this. And I want to talk to the people. Them. I want to talk to all of the subscribers from all over the world. I want you guys to listen to me. The reason I do this is to try and do some good in the world. Now, can I do it or is it working? I don't know, but I know what my protocol is and what my directive is, is to make the Caribbean a better place. Jamaica, Trinidad, Belize, all those places. Now, yeah, I know Belize is not in the Caribbean. I don't need anybody to correct me. Okay? But what I'm saying is, I am doing this for a cause. 
a good cause. And I hope my listeners can understand that and see that. Davis told News 5 that he was all cried out over the misfortune that had befallen his family, but also acknowledged that his sibling resided in the Majestic Alley neighborhood. I'm a person, I cover up or something for my brother, I understand me, but um, my brother lived through Majestic Alley and things, you understand me, so right away, you're involved in a certain, you understand me, but. Okay. You hear what his brother said? They live in a Majestic Alley and his brother is mixed up with a whole bunch of things. Listen to it, you know. I can play it again. You want me to play it again? I can play it again. Davis told News 5 that he was all cried out over the misfortune that had befallen his family, but also acknowledged that his sibling resided in the Majestic Alley neighborhood. I'm a person that cover up or something for my brother, understand me, but um, my brother lived through Majestic Alley and things, understand me, so right away, you're involved in a certain, understand me, but nothing where I really. So, I play that again on the year where the brother say them come from a certain part of town so they know say them associate with certain gang but if you notice the brother he cut that part of the conversation short that's because majority of the families that is in Belize they're enabling like I said before Belize is a little bit different. It uh, the, 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 the gangs is usually intertwined with, with families. And uh, you see it right here when the stepfather gets flingwe, the son gets flingwe, and then the other son, baby son, gets flingwe. So a tree man in the ghost crypts side of town get fling with. Now, like I say, them come from a certain lane. Like what the brother said, that's why certain things jump off. But the police are act like them don't know what happened, but they know what happened. Them know say the George Street man them do this thing. Now I want to talk to the subscribers them again. I know I am not a prime minister. I know I am not no big time doctor or anything. I, maybe I would call myself, I shouldn't say a high priest or a vigilante. <laughs> but I am a speaker who's trying to make a difference. I thank all the subscribers them who is with me, who's not with me. Because a lot of the stuff I speak on this channel, it has came to pass. So people know when I do my analysis, I go deep and study a subject. For example, like the beryllium robbery. It was no big surprise to me how that robbery played out because I did the correct analysis and at the same time trying to solve a problem. I try to help the police them to blow out. That's crazy. And it's funny. I don't like police. I don't like politicians. And I do not like gangs. So, how crazy is that? Hmm? I hate politicians. I don't like police. And I definitely hate gangs. Am I contrary? <laughs> but I do support some of the police action. And when a politician does something uh, that's, you know, good, I guess, <laughs> I, I'll give them their, their props. And uh, gang members too. 
But one thing I'm very upset at gang members because what they do, they kill off them neighborhood while the politician and the rich people them live big. The police have to go inside there and then people start eating the police. So it's it's like a never ending cycle because you have to know our system the, the whole world that we live in right now it was created out of a court system and the court system dates back in the BC time we're still following that model where the court has the last say and they create the laws and I guess address the laws as they feel fit now a lot of court rulings they say they go by facts but it is not facts sometimes the evidence is not facts you see how confusing that is did I just confuse you guys but guess what that's all the system we live in operates so once the system operates like that you could see that the system needs fixing but nobody's gonna fix it you just have to ride it out with that said the George Street man them they are the premier gangster in Belize and anybody who try and take their stripes they get oppressed them get wiped out man and man have taken shots off of them and get rid of a couple of them but it seems like George Street them come in like cockroach them they're easily to convert other gang members from other neighborhood to actually go do their bidding and that's how Jard Street operate I don't know how they do it they must be reading the 48 laws of power or the Machiavelli book because they are able to convince other people from other gangs to join up with them and go do stuff for them and I don't know how they do it but with that said I end it all start it I'm a bridging drunk or that him do a little drop for the same way I'm running it so I run it feed me a support who me can support likewise if you guys can support me and you guys supporting me I appreciate it I have not never asked for money I have the snapchat or whatever chat they got and I've never I haven't even activated that so I just want my subscribers them to know that I am doing this from the heart try and make a change and if we do it together when I say we me and you yes you we can make a change and we can make things better George Street, don't know if you chill out. My name is Countryman. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and click on another video. I'm out.